okay now we will start our number series okay so first of all let's see the what is the trick to solve the number series questions hmm. whenever you get the trick uh, whenever you get the any series okay first of all just check whether it is increasing series or decreasing series okay if it is increasing decreasing then we will follow some steps okay we will see it later okay but if the series is decreasing first and then further it is just increasing okay for example like this uh, 5 2 7 9 11 see this first it is decreasing and then all are increasing okay first it is decreasing and then all are increasing okay so this type of series okay first this is decreasing and then all increasing for this we will follow certain steps and third is alternatingly increasing and decreasing for example like this 2 5 3 4 4 3 5 2 are you getting it alternatively this is increasing right but this is what this is decreasing 4 5 4 3 2 so alternatingly increasing or decreasing and this can also be the example of this type of series see this this uh, increasing then decreasing then decreasing again are you getting it okay but then now it will be increasing okay again increasing okay so this type of series also comes here I have uh, why it is alternating see this 2 1 0 this is one series then 4 5 6 this is one series and third series is 3 4 5 this is another series okay so this is the combination of 3 series and this is the combination of 2 series okay so all the combination of series comes in this category so now you have to categorize your series into this one this one or this one okay so whenever any series come you have to decide whether it is in this category or in this category or in this category fine when you have decided for example your series is this decreasing and then all increasing then what you have to do you have to just check its multiplication factor okay you have to just check its multiplication factor because usually in 90 percent cases this type of series has multiplication factor only okay but if you find that your series is combination of some series then first split by skipping one number for example in this series we have split our series by skipping one number see this 2 skipped 5 3 skipped 4 4 skipped 3 5 so we have got our one series and second series how we have got 5 skipped 3 4 skipped 4 3 skipped 5 2 right so in this series we have got our series by skipping one number but um, sometimes we don't get our uh, correct series by skipping one number so we have to skip two numbers for example in this series two four three two numbers we have skipped then one five four two numbers we have skipped then zero two numbers we have skipped then minus one okay in this way and similarly four three one skipped five four zero skipped six okay so in this series we have skipped two number so in short in this type of category when it is combination of few series you have to just find the uh, series which you are getting okay so you will get it by skipping one number or two number okay most in 99 percent cases combination of three and two series are only come okay but to just increase the difficulty level sometimes combination of four series also can come for that you just have to split the 
uh, series by skipping three numbers okay so you got if you get the series in which first is decreasing and then all, all increasing just check its multiplication factor okay and if it is alternating series you have to first step is what you have to split it into the individual series okay after that if in this case after even multiplication factor you think that you have not got your answer if you think that your question is not yet solved then you have to follow these steps and in this type of series when you have split your series into the uh, individual series then for each series you have to follow these steps okay and for increasing and decreasing series you have to follow these steps so in short these steps are the core of our strategical trick fine so what was our first step first step is you have to categorize your series okay if it is increasing decreasing then directly follow these steps if it is decreasing and then all increase then first apply the multiplication factor because maximum time it is 90 percent cases it is multiplication factor only you will get your answer okay but if you don't get your answer then follow these steps and if you, your series is combination of some series then split it into the individual series and for each series just follow these steps now let's see what are these steps okay first first uh, let me tell you one thing more if your series you find that your series is increasing then you have to move in the series from left to right in case of increasing series. in case of decreasing series you have to move from right to left okay in increasing left to right in decreasing right to left now let's see what are the steps you have to follow okay first of all just see whether the series is prime number series or not if it is prime number series then just apply the prime number that what will be the next prime number and you will get your answer if you if it is not prime number then let's see it is if it is n squared series for example if it is the combination of combination of some squares numbers okay okay if we, even if it is not then just check whether it is the combination of some cube cubes okay even if it, if it is not then just check if it is squares and plus minus some factor for example uh, this series just take the just let's see this series 24 35 this see this series this is what this is what 4 square 16 minus 1 this is 5 square 25 minus 1 this is 6 square minus 1 this is 7 square minus 1 so this type of series is what n square plus minus 1 n series okay so if you have uh, got that your series is not even prime not even square series not even cube series then just check for this square plus minus 1 and plus minus n factor even if it is not this then just check for this q plus minus n series okay so this also similarly like this series only okay but if if you don't get from any of the series then you have to check the jumps between the series jumps what i am saying that this jumps is the that how they are uh, for example you can take the difference or even the multiplication for example if your series is like this okay then what is the jump jumps are the difference okay difference is what very very high it is 15 here then 30 then it becomes 60 are you getting it the jumps are becoming high okay if the jumps are becoming high then most of the cases it is the multiplication factor only see this jumps are very high what is the multiplication factor just check 15 into 2 30 30 into 2 60 60 into 2 120 right so in most of the cases when the jumps are high it is the multiplication fact uh, by getting the multiplication you can get your answer if the jumps are low for example this jumps are c 4 6 8 they are stock too close jumps are low right when the jumps are low it is usually you will get your answer using the addition factor addition factor here is what plus 2 plus 2 
plus 2 plus 2. So next number will be what? Plus 2 that is 14 will be the next number. Right? And if you don't get whether the jumps are high or low then it's simple. Just check both multiplication factor also and addition factor also for that series. Okay? Because in many of the cases usually in starting when you are starting the questions in starting you will not get whether it is high jumps or low jumps so in starting just go for both check the multiplication factor also as well as addition factor and just go for from which you are getting your answer okay now if okay now fine now after getting the factors if you get your answer it's very good directly if you don't get your answer then just see the factors factors means this just see this here it is just into 2 into 2 into 2 it is very simple here also it is simple plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 also simple okay plus but just let's see this example just a minute Okay, this okay, for example, this is your C, then how you will get it? Okay, just let's see the multiplication addition factor both because we are not getting whether the jumps are high or low. Okay, so let's see how you will solve this question. I'm just giving you an example. Okay. 5, what is the uh, addition factor here? Plus 2. What is the addition factor here? 7, this 9. Right? What is the addition factor here? 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 8, 18. Right? Now, let's see the multiplication factor. Are you getting any multiplication factor? No, no direct multiplication we are getting, but something we can get. Right? 5 into 1 plus 2 right similarly 7 into 2 plus 2 7 to 14 14 plus 2 16 16 into 2 32 32 plus 2 34 so see this are you getting something we are getting a certain relationship okay but if you see this addition factors okay and you are not getting anything just take these factors also as in series and and try to find out relationship between them okay but use this step only at the end whenever when you don't get your answer by following all the steps right i know you must be little confused that what steps uh, that you must be not getting the clear idea about all these steps okay but when we will do our question you will get the complete idea of all these steps because these steps will really help you to solve any type of number series okay we will see the uh, previous year 10 previous 10 year question bank in our further videos and you will get to know how we are applying this strategical trick how we are applying all these steps to solve the uh, number series questions okay so please follow the other uh, further videos so that you can uh, just have the clear idea how to apply this trick thank you